Okay, I'm going to try to record something and show you how to use Snapchat on your phone. Now, I'm, my Snapchat is, is in here, and I'm going to open that up. Right here is the Snapchat, and I'm going to click on that with my thumb. Okay, this is in trial mode, so forgive me on that. Um, up here, right now, what it's doing is it's, it's utilizing the camera. <laughs> Look, the forever camera right there. And what I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to touch this. Whenever I'm hovering over this with the arrow, that is where my thumb is going to go. So I'm just going to click that camera and turn it around Oop, on me, okay? Now, I want to be able to... This is so weird. I want to be able to get the lenses to come up. A lot of people will call them filters, but they're not filters. They're really called lenses. And this is the camera. This is where I would take a selfie. And all I have to do to take a selfie is to push the button at the bottom right here, this circle. And that would be a selfie. And see how it just took that selfie? Now, if I wanted to, I could go up here and I can click the T with my finger and it will pull up something that will let me type. And I'll say Sally, um, Sally's demo, okay? And then it will put it wherever you want it. You can just drag it with your finger, which is what I did. I dragged it with my finger. Um, I can also go to the top and click the T again. And when I do, it'll make it bigger text like that. And I can click it again and it centers it and then click it again and it goes back to the original format. Now if I want to, I can also write on the screen by touching this button right here and picking a color on this little rainbow right here with my finger. And now I'm just gonna use my finger to run across the picture and I'm just doing this, you know, with my finger, that's all I'm doing, okay? Now, I don't have to keep that if I don't want to. I can back it up and get rid of it like that, okay? Um, also, if I want to, it's right now it shows that this is still in trial mode, but right here is the download. If I wanted to just download this picture right now, I could. Or I can go over here to the right and hit that arrow that keeps blinking at me. And what this does, this goes through and allows me to choose friends or, or both, my story, like I could put this on my story, I could put it on one of my friends' Snapchats and it would send directly to them. Um, I don't wanna put it on my story, but if I did, I would click that, I would just touch that right there and it would make the check mark. And then I would go down to the bottom and click that and it would put it on my story. Now I don't want it on my story, but I'm gonna show you what my story looks like. I'm not gonna keep this picture, I'm gonna go backwards. I keep clicking this. And I'm going to do that. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go swipe. I am going to be swiping my finger across the screen from right to left. And then this goes over and shows my story. Now I'm going to click my story. And this shows you some things I did yesterday with some of the funny lenses. With the dog. This was, <laughs> we put oranges in our mouth and we're being silly, okay? All right, now if I want to, I can watch the news. Like there's some things about, uh, there's Muhammad Ali on CNN and keep clicking through and it'll change from story to story. And then I can swipe down from the top. All I did was I used, put my finger up here and I swiped it down. And when I did, it turned the news feed off for me. Now I'm going to go back and I'm going to swipe from left to right, I swiped across. Now it might be showing the opposite to you, I'm not sure. I don't think it is, but I swiped from left to right to go back to the camera, okay? Now if I want to, I can also hold that button at the bottom and press it and hold it, the one in the middle at the bottom right there. <laughs> and then that will record up to six second video, okay? Now, how do I get these silly pictures? All right, I'm going to put my thumb in the middle of the screen and tap right on my face and hold it. And when I do that, it does that grid up on my face, so it like reads my face. And then see how at the bottom it shows these lenses right here? If you just move them over with your finger and put them in there, then there you go. There's the dog. Um, here's my character Bertha. 
hello, this is Bertha Bolton. Um, and <laughs> sorry. And then this is like, you know, put a nice little filter on my face and made my eyes look younger and brighter. Um, I like those. And then there's this silly one with whatever this animal is. Here's uh, a really big cheeked girl. Okay. And then here's this kind of scary one. Oh, goodness gracious. Um, here's a new one I haven't seen. Oh, that's really beautiful. Hmm. Um, and then you, you just keep scrolling these across and it changes your face. Oh, here's the one with the with the sideways mouth. And here's the pretty filter. Watch this. Look how young I look. <sighs> you know, that one. Um, and then there's uh, a rabbit. And these change every day. And some of them will say, like, open your mouth. And when you do, it will... Okay, let's see what it does. Ah, okay, so it makes my eyes explode. Then there's the face swap. You've seen that with people. And you get somebody else in the screen with you. And, you know, you swap faces. And then there's also the picture swap. So face to photo. So, like, if I went through here... And like, here's my daughter. If I wanted to trade faces with her, that's kind of weird. It's what it would do. Some of them work pretty well and some of them don't. Um, oh, look, here's one of my silly characters. Hey. <laughs> um, so anyway, that's just another way. Okay, that's disturbing. Let me go back to the beginning. All right, so this is just me and... This is what you do. All right, now, I happen to have, do you see at the bottom where there's a one? That's a notification. That's a personal notification that somebody has sent me a Snapchat. And what I'll do is I'll click on the one, and then it looks, it came from my daughter, and I'll check that. Not on the screen, but I will check it. Okay? Now, if I want to watch other people's stories, I'm going to swipe over to the other side. Also, notifications will come up down here as well. See that? They'll come up here too that will show me, but I can also swipe to get there. And I can go through and like watch some of my friends and see what they're doing. She's talking, but I, and you do have to hit the volume to have it come up. Okay, people get really silly on here. So um, go in and try it out. You can also add people by clicking this at the top. It's the little ghost at the top. You click that, and then you go add friends. Um, you can look at your friends. You can see who added you. There's some other features to it, too. You can go in and do your profile picture. What it'll do is it will take several pictures of you in sequence. I got a... I think, wait, how do I scroll up? Uh, how do I get back? Oh, cancel. I don't know what I need to do. I don't want to do that. No, nope, that's the stock prices. Oh, I've totally gotten screwed up. You can go into the settings and change things around. Um, trying to just get rid of it and I can't seem to get rid of it. Okay, there it goes. I just, I finally hit the thing at the bottom and, and went up. Okay, so go in there, try out Snapchat. Let me know if you have any questions and we'll see if we can um, and get you a little bit more trained on it. And go add me as a friend, Sally Hendrick, all one word, S-A-L-L-Y-H-E-N-D-R-I-C-K. I hope you enjoy the video. Bye. How do I turn this off? Okay. Whew, too many technology things just floating around. <laughs> I got it. Bye.